undeniably celestial bodies have some influence on us. For example, we know that the moon is one of the main causes of the tides on our planet. However, too many people give stars and other celestial bodies too much power and, and that is really crazy. So let's discuss it in detail. So we know, as I said, that moon and the sun influence our tides, mainly the moon, but the sun as well, due to gravity forces as the science at the moment understands it. And, um, and that, is a, that is a fact, we could say, that's like really undeniable, you know, but at the same time, no one has actually uh, said something like, oh, I was driving my car and suddenly I couldn't shift the second gear uh, because the, the moon was above me or the sun was shining somewhere there. You know, it doesn't happen. Or, oh, I wanted to climb up the stairs, but I couldn't because the stars were aligned in this way and they didn't allow me to do it. You know, that never happens. So all those celestial bodies, they do have some influence, but obviously they do not make us do things, you know. Uh, what they could do maybe, you know, steer us towards certain things, maybe uh, create certain tendencies in our life, but they absolutely have no control of our lives, you know, and you shouldn't believe that they do, because if you do, you are doomed, you will be disempowered, you will believe that there is some outside force other than you that controls your life, and that's ridiculous, and, and all sorts of people have proven it, that it is ridiculous that we all have control, you know, no matter how disempowered someone is, if they go through certain trainings and um, coaching or whatever, they, they can become really empowered and create incredible things in life, you know, end of the story. No matter what beliefs they have, whether they believe they've been cursed through generations or, or I don't know, it doesn't matter, it changes. Now, every now and then you will come across someone who strongly believes that actually stars and other celestial bodies do influence us in a big way. And that is fine. Do not go into argument with them. So how does that work? Well, the person started believing into that for whatever reason. And due to them having a belief into that, they started creating situations in which they were proven right. So they were coming across people who were the exact examples of what they believe, you know, situations that were supporting the evidence that they believed, you know, and it was like a self-fulfilling prophecy. So do not argue with them because they are right. But at the same time, they are not, you know, because if you look at statistics, people who have studied this in detail, in depth, there is no correlation, you know, clearly there is no uh, evidence of uh, sun or the moon or other stars influencing our lives other than somehow my marginally and, you know, uh, anecdotally, um, as, as we could say, you know, so don't believe that for a second, okay? I hope that was useful. Now, if you have some other opinions, uh, obviously let's have a discussion about this in the comments. Um, thanks for, for commenting on this. And by the way, I, I find it more and more difficult now to answer uh, the comments because I, I'm getting so many comments now, but I will make an attempt to always answer the comments on new videos within the first week. So if you watch my videos in the first week or five days at least, I will make an effort to answer those those comments, you know, so be patient, okay? Uh, thanks a lot, take care.